<laughs> the newspaper here at the Pomona. It's the Cal Poly newspaper. It's a, it's a newspaper. Uh, the school newspaper. Our on-campus newspaper. No, I didn't. No, not really. Yes, they do. Uh, yeah, I was like. Uh, no, not until now. Yes, I did. Uh, I did not know that. Somewhat, yeah. Sometimes. Uh, I've never read it, to be honest. I flip through it every week. Sometimes, yeah. rarely. Oh my God. When I see it and I pick it up, when I remember to, when I see it, when I pass by, uh -huh. pick it up. If I get a hold of it, like if it happens to be on a desk, then I'll look at it and read it. On one poly post issue, they had reviews of like restaurants. All the sports stuff is good. I like the idea of uh, branding it as polypost.com, as I've kind of seen you guys starting to do, so I think that'll help. I like it because it's free and we could just read it anywhere in the restroom whenever we're eating. The, the articles that they put out, like the sex ed and the fashion thing and the kid who hates life. Yeah, Life of Polly. I, I kind of like it because it's very funny and, you know, very original. Uh -huh. And it's the drawings, it's like, you know, simple. It's not like, you know, like graphic designing or anything. So I kind of like it. You got all the cool columns, Hating Life, what? Armageddon, you know, all kinds of cool stuff. I love reading that. Maybe advertise more about their, about being online. It's interesting. It's uh, maybe some more, maybe some more articles about the uh, my country and the world, other than just campus life. Girls, phone numbers, uh, free food, free extra credit. That might work. I like the advertisements, like the little golden spoon coupons. Is great. <laughs> or something that's really big, then it will get my attention. But other than that. I just watched the news. <laughs>